what is up guys welcome on back to tk's garage got a short video for you today i saw this over on uh mopar insiders i'll put it right here uh that they had the configuration thing up on dodge.com well you can go in and try to build or look at the features and build and see what the car would look like in a virtual garage of this Dodge Charger EV Daytona frigging disaster. So I figured the only positive thing for us to do is to go in and build it. I don't know if we're going to get the same panel gaps that they're getting out of those things right now at the factory, but uh, let's go ahead and take a look at it. For the longest time. all right guys welcome on in i got a video for you here it looks like they dropped the configuration uh thing now for the dodge charger even though this car is a complete and utter frigging disaster of build quality um i'm interested i want to see you know if we can configure it what we're going to do what the costs are you know i don't see any f8 green so that kind of sucks you know so we got to go with like rent a car gray let's see so they are staggered carbon and suede carbon wheels track pack track pack okay uh, go with the black interior mm, black suede black napa leather trim seats i had to go with the suede man i really liked that in my car check out the highlights got an r-wing all right patent pending front arrow pass through i wonder if they're going to get the patent for that authentic wide body Oh, okay, so the car is just wide by itself. You don't, it's not a kit. All right. Power flow. High voltage battery pack. Eh. Attitude adjustment. Is somebody going to slap the shit out of me for even considering buying one of these things? That must be what that is. All right. Digital cluster display, because I'm sure that's going to last you know 20 30 years yep all right infotainment screen all right let's get to the packages sun and sound package of course i need that gotta have it all right visualize okay i see the open doors i mean that's all cool can i get a price i'm active look like even the damn website can't stay working like for real sounds uh-oh. Oh, uh, I think I just got assaulted in my ears. That's trash. That is absolute dog shit trash. All right. X-ray view. You're going to say, does my car have X-ray vision? Or are we just X-ray viewing the actual car? Let's go. Okay, dope. So basically, if you run over anything, just expect to get blown up because that battery is going to explode. All right. Anything in the background? We got the garage. We got the studio. All right. I mean, that's cool, but you're just basically configuring the car. You can't, like, get an idea to build it. I'm a little lost here. Animations. Uh, even their website's glitching. Why does that not surprise me? Yeah, I'm tapping the hell out of these, and it won't change. <laughs> Why does this not surprise me at all? All right. Build and price. Uh, we're still looking at 2023 Chargers. We're still looking at Challengers. What? 
That's it, huh? So we can't get a build price or anything on these. Interesting. Interesting. I wonder if it would still let me build a, a Challenger. Wow. Well, now this is what's interesting. Like, is Stellantis just this dumb? Or are they leaving this on the site to, like, let people, like, remember what this car was? Because you can't order this car anymore. You can't build this car anymore. Brampton's closed. That's a wrap. So, I don't know. So there you have it, guys. <laughs> I mean... Cool, we get to play around with features on a car that, and the website doesn't completely work. Yeah, uh, what's new for Stellantis? I mean, we all, uh, I'm sure you've seen the video already where we talk about the Wagoneer S not coming out because I think they're, they know that they don't want to damage the Jeep name anymore, but they're just like, Dodge, F it. We're already, <laughs> we've already destroyed this brand. Throw that shit on the website. <laughs> you know that's what happened. They just throw it on the website. We don't care. Oh, God. Oh. Let me know what you guys think about this in the in the comment section down below. It's a bonus video, man. I thought you guys might find it funny or interesting. Go play with it. You can go to dodge.com and go play around with it. Maybe you'll break the website too. Who knows? But uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Give the video a big thumbs up if you like what I do. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And as always, stay petty, my friends.